Without objection. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Yesterday was the third anniversary of the Supreme Court's 2005 decision in the Kelo versus the City of New London case. In that decision, a divided Supreme Court ruled that the government may take people's homes and bulldoze them to make way for strip malls or other private development in order to increase tax revenue. The negative effects of this far-reaching decision places all private property rights owners at risk. No property owner is safe if the government decides that their land would serve a better purpose and be an economic gain if something bigger and more taxable were in its place. To combat the, these unjust property takings, I introduced H.R. 6219 to protect the rights of the private property owners. With this bill, all Americans now have the tools they need to fight unjust property takings and defend their homes and small businesses. The government's overstepped its bounds in taking private property from people. It's also done the wrong thing in not allowing us to drill for oil and gas in America. Uh, that's very important that we get it in our own backyard. A lot of people on the Democrat side talk about alternative energy sources, and that's good, and we as Republicans believe in that, but also we believe that we need to get energy right here in our own backyard as well as we develop Gentlemen's these technologies. Time has expired.